Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy AB. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you guys are new, please consider subscribing and turning on notification bell so you don't miss a single video. Today, I'm gonna be showing off a toy that was invented back in 1978 that inspired the Toy Story character that appeared in the first two Toy Story movies, Mr. Spell. I've always wanted a Mr. Spell, but they never really made a toy of him other than like little tiny figures. And then when they started making replicas, custom replicas of him, he didn't operate the way I would want him to operate. So I'm just waiting for someone to actually actually make a movie accurate fully operational Mr. Spell but until then I'll be held over with what the toy was inspired by that I got right under this mystery box right here that I'm about to unveil for everybody and this toy also made a very special appearance in another really popular movie out there and you guys need to pause the video right now and comment down what movie you think it is I'll give you some time all right, let's do the unveiling. Here's the unveiling. Three, two, one, boom. The original speaking spell. Now, the answer was E.T. This appeared in E.T. And I got the E.T. edition, and I'm glad I didn't get scammed because it was a really good deal for me to get this on eBay. I think I spent a little over $20 on this thing, which I think is really cool. Now, I guess you guys can see how this toy inspired Mr. Spell. He's got like the clear uh, little area right here where... Ooh. That is pretty cool and it even sounds like Mr. Spell a little bit. Apart from the E.T. thing not being on Mr. Spell in the movie or the fact that he was mainly yellow, this is a pretty good uh, close thing I got until they make a movie accurate Mr. Spell I could put in my collection. I know it's not technically Toy Story. I mean, it's close enough at the moment. Now, the one thing I will have a complaint about this uh, toy is that it doesn't repeat words that you type out. It this, In fact, it kind of plays as a game to help you with spelling, which I think is great for kids. But I've always imagined Mr. Spell, you just type whatever word you want to type out and he'll just repeat it. Hold on. But then again, Mr. Spell's called Mr. Spell for a reason, I guess. Maybe whenever Annie's playing with him, he just helps him spell like the speaking spell does. And, you know, he only repeats things whenever he's alive in front of the other toys. But nonetheless, I think that would be a pretty cool feature to have if someone made a fully operational movie accurate Mr. Spell. Because I would totally make him say a bunch of swear words because, yeah, I am super immature. And as you can already tell, yeah, it's because I definitely collect Toy Story toys for YouTube. But yeah, let's uh, try to test them out. As you can already tell, I've uh, been messing with this a little bit since I am on level B for spelling. Spell yield. That's why. Linger. Okay, that's an easy one. Where's T? Ugh. My brain's slow. Beauty. Oh no, don't tell me you made me start over. Okay, I did double check. I'm back where I was, and I did. I do think he uh, wants me to spell heaven. H e a v e n. You are right. Yep. Try squad. Squad. S q u a d. That is correct. Next spell. Haste. Haste. Right. Try squat. 
squat. Squat or squash? I'll try squat first. Hey, is it squash? Because I swear, if I get it wrong, I'm going to be pretty pissed. Q-A-U-S-H. That is incorrect. The correct spelling of squat is S-Q-U-A-T. Emotional damage! Spell error. Here, I'll spell it. Yeah, but yeah, the most I can get to get him to say a cuss word is like an abbreviated F-U, because, you know, I am very immature, and I'm very dumb at spelling, apparently. <laughs> but yeah, I guess I kind of get the concept of the toy, and it's all right for what it is. I mean, it's supposed to help kids learn how to spell, and obviously I can't spell squat, so must be pretty dumb. And it's nice that I can also play some other games on here, I think. But I'm not going to go over them because I'm pretty mad about the whole squat thing. I'm just saying that the speak and spell could be a lot better. And I hope that whenever someone makes a fully operational Mr. Spell that's accurate to Toy Story, I hope they actually allow you to like repeat whatever word you want. Because I think that would be pretty freaking funny. But yeah, for me, I'm going to have to give this toy a 6 out of 10. I mean... I always wanted one of these because I did know for a while that this is what inspired Mr. Spell, but I am a little let down, honestly. So yeah, this has been the end of my video. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, comment down below, and please subscribe and turn on notification bells so you don't miss a single video. This has been your boy, 80 out. Peace out, Rainbow Trouts.